Well, hi. Uh, well, I'm a little depressed right now. Most of my stuff is gone. I'm, ooh, I am not fond of this whole naked room. All my stuff is gone. It is just, ooh. But I have a goal plan when I go to Texas. Uh, no more smoking. I'm doing pretty good right now. Uh, eating healthier. Uh, exercising a little. Because last time, <laughs> it's another thing I'm like a little worried about Texas. Is uh, last time I was there. Uh, I I wasn't in the right state of mind. I was depressed. I was trying to get sober and clean again. <coughs> and there was all that southern food I missed so much. Uh, so by the time, within a couple of months, by late May, I got back here to Wyoming. I left late February, got back to Wyoming in late May, and I was... 98 pounds when I left Wyoming, I came back and I was pushing 130 pounds. And because I'm so short, I'm only 5 foot tall, I can't carry a lot of weight. I'm sure like on a normal height person, it would have, you know, looked normal. But I looked rough. And people were like, oh, you look healthy. And I was like, no, no, I look chubby as hell. You don't have to be nice. I'm working on it. I managed to get, to get back down to... I want to, last time I weighed myself I was 112 pounds. So this time around in Texas, I'm going to eat healthier because vegetarian, again. Last time I was a vegetarian for quite a while, last time. I was a vegetarian for quite some time and then because like I was getting strung out and stuff again because I lived on campus, I'm not blaming campus but it was just so easily accessed there. Uh, I was like really strung out and everything. And my sister-in-law, she like I looked pretty bad because I was strung out again. My sister-in-law said, uh, she was like, okay, because you're not eating meat, you're gonna die. You look like you're gonna die. I'm gonna make you start eating meat. Otherwise, you're gonna start going to the doctor, get blood work, get all this stuff done. And I was like, son of a bitch. So, but I was eating right when I was a vegetarian. I was eating, you know, protein stuff. I was eating right, I was just, I just looked really crappy, because, <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I just got a text that I had to exit out of it. But anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited, because, you know, new change. Like, last time I was running from my problems. This time, I am I'm getting on up there. I need to get out there. My dream is Austin, Texas, and damn it, I'm going to make it there. Where I'm moving, is not, it's not too far from Austin, but I can't really go to Austin right now. But, no more smoking. Uh, exercise, healthy diet, focus. That's what I'm doing. But, yeah, now, originally, God, it just depresses me. All my stuff is gone. And my keyboard is gone. Oh! That was like a stab in the heart. Right there. That is going to be a top priority shipped thing right there. Is my keyboard. I swear to God, if someone breaks it, I'm going to cry, then I'm going to get pissed off, and then they're going to get me a new one. But anyway. <sighs> yeah. Pretty excited about that. I'm pretty excited. But actually today, or earlier, a little while ago, uh, I was on Skype with my best friend Jared, and I was playing Super Mario... Or not super, 
Mario World, Super Mario, you know, on my computer and stuff. And when I play that, I get really pissed off. I should probably record myself doing that one day. It, it'll be funny. It's almost like rage quit. But anyway, and then like Nice Peter inspires me a lot because he's so uppity and happy and joyous and just, you know, and I, like he, a big thing with him is music. Like with his picture songs, he doesn't even rhyme most of the time in those songs. He just sings. And it's fun. So what I was doing is I was singing. I was narrating myself while singing it. I was cracking Jared up. I was, you know, laughing at myself. And I was talking to him, like having a conversation with him while singing. And it's fun. It's fun. I'm going to start doing that to people. It's almost like Nice Peter and Castle G's street music. It's pretty awesome. I'm gonna start doing that. Yeah. Cause it's just fun. I just had it. Anyway. It's a little update. I'm at too much time now. So, oh, I have a vlog coming out soon. I have to finish editing it. It's a bigger vlog of mine. It's, uh, it's going to have toddlers, teenagers, lots of laughter, and my, it inspired my little brother to get a channel. He is featured on both of my channels, uh, Brody's brother. It's the only thing we can think of, but he's up now. He's into the whole vlogging thing, which I'm so proud, but, uh, anyway. Tuna!